It's been from Sharks, Jason Vegas here, and I hope you're doing well. And I found yet another adults-only hotel functionally on the Las Vegas Strip. Let's pop in and see what it's like. It's the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. Before we get started, I just wanted to give a quick shout out to our Patreon members for helping the channel grow. More on that later. The Artisan Hotel is the unique, slightly off-strip property near the north end of Las Vegas Boulevard. It's famously or infamously known as a hotspot for locals and tourists alike, and its relatively small footprint still brings in a large nightly group. But what makes this quirky adults-only property worth visiting? Well, let's head inside and find out. Okay, so we're entering the main lobby here, and it looks like it starts off pretty strong. Got ourselves a couple little lion statues over here. And they've even got the hands out to shake yours, so that's always lovely. Non-smoking property, keep that in mind. Um, although that is going to change theoretically very soon, as the artisan is applying to have a marijuana lounge on the property. Until then, just make sure you're sanitizing your hands regularly. The rest of the main lobby area here. Another little selfie of uh, Vincent van Gogh. Yes, selfie as in self-portrait. <laughs> because I'm going to do that today. First elevator goes up to the hotel towers from the second to the fifth floor. So it's lovely, accompanied with hand sanitizer and a desk of some sort, it appears. There's another sitting area here in the lobby accompanied by a lamp. They're decorated specifically for Halloween right now, so you will notice the Halloween decorations in the area. Next over, we're going to find the Artisan Wedding Chapel here. It's actually locked up as of right now, um, possibly because of hotel season and more than likely because they don't have a wedding going right now, but this is the actual wedding chapel. And behind us is their centerpiece fountain. So these are the Artisan Fountains. And they're also decorated for Halloween. Like a little hot tub in here. And it doesn't look like there are too many coins in that one. I should have saved one from last night, but I don't think I used too much cash, so there's that. And then they do have a staircase that leads up. I think that's it. I'm trying to remember who that is. It looks a little Marilyn-y, but her hair is blonde, and this painting is a brunette, so I doubt that's her. Either way, that leads up to the second floor, guest rooms, and the executive office. Very pretty property, though. It's a little old school, a little kitschy. And then off to our right, they're actually doing renovations in an upcoming spa, so there's going to be an artisan spa coming to the hotel. Another waiting area here next to the hotel chicken. And then just a few vending machines and ATMs because you always have to have snacks. Gentlemen's rooms over here. Ladies' rooms here. And then they have a study lounge. I'm not sure what that means. That might be the bar. But the study is closed. I'll put some information up about that on the screen. And additionally, a neat thing I noticed is that all of the all of the furniture pieces seem to have a QR code attached to them. We're gonna have a look here. And it looks like you can actually purchase them. There's a link to the auction if you're interested in that. I'm gonna zoom in for just a second and you can scan the QR code on the screen.
Then from here, it leads outside. And this is gonna take us to the stairwell that you can take back up to your room. And if I recall correctly, down this way is the pool area. Now this is a top optional pool, so you won't get to actually do any filming inside. It looks like it's closed right now though. So I might be able to do some filming, but it looks like no, it's only gonna be registered guests, no outside food. Actually, maybe I'll pop in there and do a little tour. But that's everything here at the Artisan Hotel Boutique Las Vegas, a straightforward, simple, and fascinating little piece of lesser-known Las Vegas. Thanks for joining us. Alright, spinners and sharks, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed today's hotel tour, or found it informative, I'd appreciate a like, and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Before I go, I just wanted to take a moment to shout out our patrons. Guys, it means the world to me that you choose to support me in this way and help keep Ace of Vegas independent of the YouTube algorithm. As you know, my content isn't always sensor and advertiser friendly, so it goes a long way in keeping the channel running. If you want a more direct hand in keeping Ace of Vegas growing, I'll leave a link to the Patreon in the description box down below. In the meantime though, what are your thoughts on the Artisan Hotel? Would you pop by the bar and lounge? How do you feel about the European style pool? And most importantly, would you stay? Whatever your thoughts may be, I'd love to hear them in the comments down below. Until next time though, this is Ace of Vegas signing out, wishing you strong hands, and of course, happy spinning you guys. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva, Viva Ace of Vegas.